Hey everybody, welcome to Coach Cast TV. I'm Coach. And I'm Mrs. Coach. And I have no idea what I'm doing today. Uh, I, well, actually I do know what, what we're doing. Okay. Uh, we are listening to some baby metal. We're going down in the foxhole. We're going down to the foxhole. Okay. I like the foxhole. It's and pretty neat. The foxhole has been really cool. Mm -hmm. And I, I must say that baby metal fans have been fantastic. Yeah. Uh, they understand that it takes the brain a little bit of time to put these concepts together. To uh, mash them all up and yeah, make it work. It's like cheerleaders with metal. Uh, but it has started to grow on us. Mm -hmm. And recently we did uh, their song Monochrome and it was a piano version. I loved it. And it was uh, eye-opening mm -hmm. regarding their talent. Their voices. Uh, yes. Just from a vocal perspective. Mm -hmm. uh, it, it, I'm glad we did it, even though it's not my normal preference in music, mm -hmm. because it gave me personally a lot more respect for the group mm -hmm. uh, just to see their vocal prowess. Yes. And uh, I am excited because today we're going to do the live version of that same song. Mm -hmm. We were told we must do it because it's drastically different. Oh, that's going to be interesting. And so we're excited to do Baby Metals Monochrome from PIA Arena in 2023 mm -hmm. coming up next. All right. I am excited to see the difference mm -hmm. in this one and the one we have seen. And we have subtitles. Okay, good. Way, which is good. Before they even start singing, uh, it's clear that this is drastically different oh, yeah. than what we saw before. And their concerts have to just be a trip. Uh, <laughs> seriously, uh, the the instrumentals are fantastic. Mm -hmm. And uh, I know that way back in their beginning, based on the comments that we've read, mm -hmm. uh, they didn't have a live band. They had the backing track, and they did have, uh, like, essentially actors who pretended to play but they actually used backing tracks okay uh now they have a live band that uh i'm telling you these folks rock mm -hmm. and these these ladies put on a heck of a show they do this the starting out of this video it's actually you can you can almost feel the anticipation yeah yeah something's about to just something's let it go. gonna happen okay. that's right
I'm going to call it about 40-ish percent into this, that this is my favorite of theirs so far. I literally cannot determine whether I like this one or just the one which is their vocals. Mm -hmm. They're actually great. Both of them are. And what amazes me with this one is the way that they just all harmonize so well together, even with the band in the back. Well, the choreography, yes. everything about the performance is top notch. Yes. It's very, very well done. Mm -hmm. uh, and they clearly must work many, many, many hours yep. to, to be this in sync. But uh, all the songs of theirs we've done mm -hmm. have been very good, mm -hmm. even if the brain had a hard time <laughs> comprehending it the more that i listened to it you know editing and so forth it was like oh yeah that's actually pretty good stuff yeah uh but this one just and i don't know if it's because we've already heard it mm -hmm. even though we didn't hear it we didn't hear it like this no mm -mm. uh but i don't know what it is but i like this one i think best of all so far okay lot of people You know, it, it's easy to get caught up in it and forget we're even doing yes. a reaction video, to be quite honest mm -hmm. with you. They are uh, just something else. Well, I mean, just look out at the crowd. Mm -hmm. You don't see all of that because it's dark, you know, and you see like the front. But I mean, just look at the crowd. They're way up yeah, there, too. Yeah, they are. Uh, wow. Yeah, I mean... Uh, clearly, uh, they don't have any fear of heights, I guess, because yes, that's not. up there. Uh, but uh, their interaction with the crowd, their crowd, the crowd at baby metal <laughs> concerts has to just be on another level. They're just awesome. Uh, they're, they're vocal. Mm -hmm. uh, they're active. We've yeah. seen like the circle pits mm -hmm. and, and the walls of death mm -hmm. and all these things. Yeah. Uh, and uh, this, I just think their fandom, there's something special about their fandom. Mm -hmm. it's, it's really incredible.
Well, I have to say that was one I wish didn't end. Yeah, it was. They are just, they're just great. I mean, I I know that not too many people, you know, on the, you know, U.S. coast in the U.S. know too much about this group. But I'm going to tell you what, this group is really, really good. Well, I mean, there's clearly a lot of U.S. and Mm -hmm. and other countries that know about them. But you're right that they're probably not in the mainstream. Yeah, they're underrated. The way that a lot of just, you know, household names are. But I do think their popularity is growing. And they're still very young and and Mm -hmm. have a long way to go. And uh, when I was watching that, one thing that popped in my mind that, uh, we've seen, I think, in a few of their performances now, is the lead singer, I think her name, if I'm correct, is Sue Metal. Mm-hmm. She does not uh, stand in the front with yeah. the other two behind her, which you see in a lot, lot of groups. Mm-hmm. Uh, when the, the lead singer singing, they're up front. Yeah. She gives them the front. Yes. They all three work together, though, and it works well. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, it's a it's a show. It's a, yeah. but it's not only a show. That was good music. And it also too the one thing that stands out to me with this group too, they actually showed the band in the back. Yeah. Several they give those gentlemen or ladies wh- whichever they are because you don't know they they've got their stuff on. They give them front and center. Yeah. They did that multiple times. Yeah. Which is great. Yeah. If I guess what I would say about this one is if baby metal was a conflict in my mind, this, the two versions of this song fixed that for me. And uh, now I can just say, I like it. Mm -hmm. And I say that a lot on this channel, uh, but I I did. I liked that. This was a very unique combination. And I still cannot choose whether I like just the vocal one or this one. I think they're both equally great. I think it just depends. In their own way. Yeah, yeah, it depends on what you're drawn to. Right. That makes it. it And and maybe just the mood you're in on any given day when you go to listen to something. But they were both fantastic. And Mm -hmm. uh, what she could do in the studio, she did. uh, On stage. On stage, yeah. It was impressive. Great. Anyway, uh, yeah, they've grown on us. Uh, We loved it. And uh, for those of you who said, don't go to another song till you do this, you were correct. Mm -hmm. This this was fantastic. So uh, for now, if you would, uh, please throw a thumbs up uh, on the video. Make sure you're subscribed. And ring that bell. And tell us some more that you'd like to see us do. We'll see you guys next time on CoachCast TV.